Piano do Costello enjoys a beautiful setting on the north bank of the Lima River estuary. It was an important seaport during the Age of Discovery. Standing on the hill of Santa Lucia is the massive Santa Lucia Basilica. Modeled on the Sacre Coeur in Paris, inside three rose windows illuminate the interior and exceptional frescoes. The altar and inner dome are interwoven and considered to be among the most beautiful in all of Portugal. There are exceptional panoramic views from the top, including a very special bridge. In 1878, Gustav Eiffel constructed a double-deck cast-iron bridge across the Lima River. It doesn't take long to recognize his very distinct style and flair. Like all of his projects, it has outlived its projected survival date. It does get constant upkeep and is partially closed for some maintenance at this time. Ponte de Lima is a market town on the south bank of the Lima River, which flows west from Spain. It faces a magnificent Roman bridge that gave the city its name. Its setting, together with its friendly, laid-back atmosphere, makes it one of the loveliest small towns in Portugal. It was founded on the site of a Celtic settlement and developed by the Romans. They celebrate their medieval history along with Folklorico in early June of each year. It's all in fun and everyone has a great time. Food is, of course, hot right off the grill, and there's plenty of it. They are very proud of their old and well-used Roman bridge. The Folklorical Parade begins at 11 a.m. and there is lots of excitement in everyone's preparation. These are all separate dance groups. Each has identification and a member carrying a pole with participation and competition banners on it. The girls wear floppy shoes that slip on their feet continuously and must take a lot of practice to walk on, especially on these cobblestone streets.
the parade ends and there is a short break before the Folklorico competition begins. Portugal is a delight to visit. Its small size and exceptional rules make it easy to get around. The variety is surprising. Green mountains, rivers, and broad agricultural plains open to ocean vistas of long sandy beaches and deep coves that harbor fleets of fishing and pleasure boats. Historic sites are throughout the country. All this is backdrop to one of the warmest, friendliest countries to be found anywhere. It's the people who make the difference and their smiles are warm and welcoming. This is Portugal. You'll see all of this and more on an Ama Waterways River Cruise.